I was uh, doing some welding, and uh, overhead welding, and getting a lot of sparks down my neck. And also, I was working near some white walls and uh, getting some reflection, some sunburn from, or welding burn from reflection, and uh, things like that. So in order to prevent the sparks from going down my neck, what I did is I, I made this thing, which uh, attaches to my helmet. I'll show you how I did it. And it keeps the uh, sparks out of my neck from going down my neck, and I can also wrap it around the front to protect my throat. Here's the uh, cloth part. It is 64 centimeters this way and 44 centimeters that way, which is roughly, uh, what is that, uh, 2 feet, 25 uh, inches rather. And this way it is uh, about 17 inches. Probably vary with uh, different masks. And I cut this curve based on my helmet. I literally just wrapped it inside my helmet where I wanted it to go, marked it with my soapstone and uh, cut it. This is a piece of Velcro. On this side I put the uh, hooks and on the uh, helmet side are the loops. And I put the dark side, this is the inside towards my hair. This is the uh, dark side to keep light from reflecting around inside the helmet. So this helps. This is on the outside of the helmet. It re helps reflect the light away. Inside the helmet here it's hard to see because of the black on black, but uh, this is the loop side of the Velcro. I just stitched it all the way around inside the rim. And it's easier to see on the outside because you can see the stitching. So here's the stitching. Uh, I started down here below this and literally just about uh, every five millimeters I think it was I put in a, I drilled a hole. So I just used a, I used a Dremel with a small drill bit. That's what I used. But any kind of drill I pre-marked it and then I drilled them and the width of course is the width of your velcro and all the way around so you just stitch them in there and you can see on this side a little bit stitch them in there and then I use a white glue on the outside to protect the uh, thread the thread must be cotton do not use polyester thread because it will it will the, uh, the heat and light from the uh, welding will just uh, cause it to fail really quickly. So that's all there is to this piece, the drilling and the stitching. And here it is reinstalled. Just uh, run the Velcro in contact with the, the other side of it. It goes all the way around. It's easy to peel out. protects your neck from sunlight, from uh, welding sparks, from grinding. Uh, people overhead. So anyway, that's uh, some built-in head and neck protection for a welding helmet. Hope you found it interesting.